Allie. Uh, Hello. Welcome to the Band of the Month for April. Thank you so much, Tyson. No problem. Thank you for uh, coming and chatting next to Rutledge. Rutley? Rutley. Rutley. Rutley, Rutley, and Rutl Rutley, Rutley and Rutledge Park. Rutledge Park, yeah. <laughs> Something like that. He's, he's great to have. I'm so stoked he could make yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, so your band of the month uh, single is Break Strong. Yes. It came out in 2020, yes, I believe. It did. Uh, can you tell me a little bit about the song? Absolutely. So Break Strong was originally written about a huge breakup that I'd gone through. So I thought, what better time to write and sort of get all of the pain and all of the hurt flushed out of my system into some lyrics. And it actually propelled me into writing some more quite uh, soulful ballads and now into my next generation of songs and what I'm about to release. And it really reached out to a lot of people um, in hard times in their lives and it connected me to my fans on a deeper level. And I'm just forever grateful for that song. So I'm excited that it's the feature. about new music coming up uh is it chasing the light is chase the sun, chase the yeah. sun? yes chase the sun Ch is my next one. okay tell me about that when does that come out so chase the sun is coming to all streaming platforms on friday april 7th i changed around the release date because of when i found out of band of the month i thought what better time and i actually wrote the song for my sister she's older than me by two years and we used to travel around since we were like I don't even know, 12 years old. We were in CISV, which was a local program here, and it just propelled us into this world of travel, and she's always been my best friend and all of that, and I thought, what better time now than to release something all about our adventures together. So that's coming up. I remember things that you're telling me now Even is the hardest part I haven't told Remembering that smile back when you were young Back when all we wanted to was chase it uh, I recently learned that Vince Vaccaro, former Band of the Month, yeah. like several times he's been Band of the Month over the years, uh, produces all of your music. Tell me how you came about working with Vince. <laughs> okay, so Vince and I became friends back when I first moved to Tofino from Victoria. I was about 21 years old, and the first time I ever worked with him, it was with my good friend Mike Jennings, who we actually worked together um, as a duo for a couple of years. And then I just ended up reaching out to him one day, realizing I have so much material that's just been sitting in my voice memos that I really want to bring to human life and bring to reality and bring to another form and when I thought of who I'd want to work with I immediately thought of Vince and now since then I've written and worked with him for since I was 23 years old and I'm very grateful to have him in my life. Well thank you so much for chatting with us and and taking photos with us all day and hanging out with uh, Rutley here. Thanks Rutley. All right. Us all right. Have a great, great one. <laughs> you too. Thank you so much. Ah!